Let's talk downstairs. Cozy as this place is, there's someone I'd like you to meet. We really went overboard with this place. Feel free to look around.
me introduce you to Davenport. He's been helping me with some reconnaissance. Keeping an eye on Appalachia. Oh, so good to meet you. The Overseer has been so excited to see everyone again. Once you've acquainted yourself with our new arrivals, I may have some field work for you. I couldn't have pulled this place off without him. Let's talk. Pretty crazy out there, huh? I know we have a lot to catch up on. But first, I have to ask. Did you finish the inoculation against the Scorched Plague? Please, it's vitally important. Good, because we're gonna need a lot more of it. Have you been to the mountains lately? It's not just us anymore. People from outside Appalachia are coming in. I snuck around two of the larger groups and saw them both building. Walls, housing, defensive positions. They're coming to stay. Each and every one of them is walking into a medical crisis they don't even know about. I don't know if you've been following the rumors, but there's something in the mountains. No one's managed to get into it yet, but one thing's for certain. It's a vault. I eavesdropped on some of the newcomers, and whatever is inside there has gone from speculative guesses to full-blown fantasy. Stories of untold riches would draw groups of people even before we turn the world into a wasteland. Hope and greed are powerful motivators. I don't want to lead us down the wrong track, but I've got my suspicions. The gold people are finding in the rivers can't be a coincidence. But first, we need to make sure the newcomers don't get infected. Judging by the architecture, the ones to the north are the old Raider Pals that crazy robot Rose keeps going on about. You might, uh... Need to talk to her about them. See if she can arrange a meeting or, or whatever their word is for we need to talk, don't shoot us. The ones to the south look more like a caravan of families, but who knows what they've been through. Don't let your guard down around either of them. Oh, yeah. I can't remember the official title. 
You'd think it'd be burned in my head with how many times I played that for everyone. The reality is a little different, though, isn't it? Prepare for the future. <sighs> Thank you. Really. It's good to have my vault family around again. Anyway, I'm sure you must have other questions. We can talk about them now if you want. Or if you're ready to head out, just be careful out there. Make yourself right at home. Hello. We're always happy to have visitors. I'm always delighted to see a resident of Vault 76. Well, former resident. Vault 76 is a family. We'll get through this together. Pretty hypocritical for me, of all people, to take off on my own. <laughs> At first, I was just racing ahead. Hoping that if there was any trouble, I'd hit it first. And then there were the nukes. The scorched plague. Seeing my old neighborhood bombed to pieces. I, I needed time. Me too. I... Thank you. The real question is, how do you live with yourself, knowing that's what you've done? Honestly, you worry hope and bargain and wish it's not true and then one day you wake up and it just doesn't bother you anymore you've blinded yourself so you can keep going i grew up here my parents used to live just down the hill if there's one neighborhood I'm rebuilding first, it's this one. Sometimes I honestly thought they'd be the last things I'd get to say to everyone. Well, let me see. Oh, look at that. Yeah, I think that's everything. It's been a long journey, hasn't it? For both of us. Appalachia has changed. We've changed.
I... You're welcome. I'm just glad I can be here in person now. All right. Go ahead. That's just it. I don't know. I thought they had let me into their plans, that we were special. But now I'm wondering if we were all just one big experiment to them. Just like everyone else. And what happens once there's more nukes landing on Appalachia than she can take? I know. You did what you were asked. A and so did I. But now we need to think for ourselves more. Build the America and the Appalachia we want. Stay careful out there. Together we've made Appalachia safer. But she still has fangs. Even with the arrival of the new settlers, Appalachia remains a dangerous place. Never let your guard down. Oh, it's so good to see everyone again. Stay careful out there. Together we've made Appalachia safer. But she still has fangs.
Building this place up is hard work. Uh-uh, I got here first. You can go find some other spot. Desk fan? Oh, who carries around a desk fan? It ain't easy when you have to force your way in. I could really use some bobby pins. As many as I can get my hands on. What do you have on you? Beggars can't be choosers. Sometimes one is all it takes. So, you found Buff out useful then? It's a means to an end, usually. Nothing better training could have prepared you for. Commands respect, natural born leader. Just a tad bossy. <sighs> What's the difference, really? I'm the brains. He's the brawn.
Whoa, whoa. Just a friend here, not a threat. Just had some questions for you. You came out of the vault, right? I thought it was empty. Wait, is the door still open? My partner and I need a way into that vault. We got a tip from the Wayward. Heard of the place? A new bar down the road. So this guy told us that... After you gave him the last of our caps? And he said that inside that vault is the... You know, that's where the big one is. Our last chance to turn our lousy luck around. You know, the thing that brought everyone back. The treasure. But... I told you, Lacey. The guy was scamming us. But... Those were the last of our caps. No. Someone has to know something. We're just gonna stick it out until we find them. Wonderful. Thanks for answering some questions for us, I suppose. Seems only fair I return the favor. Anything we can answer for you? Happy to tell you what I know, which isn't much. Someone made a broadcast not too long back about there being some kind of treasure buried in Appalachia. We don't know what, we don't know where. With people as desperate as they are, it's meant everyone with a functioning radio has come back to try and see if they can get a piece of it. Monsters or no? Guy we met at the Wayward. Carter, I think was his name? He gave us a couple of leads to chase down, in exchange for all our money. Up to us now to make something of them. About Appalachia? Other than it's a graveyard? There's that. We haven't been here real long, but from what we've been able to piece together, the area got hit pretty hard. Not long after, well, these things showed up. The Scorched. They're merciless. They seem to have cleaned up whoever the bombs might have missed. Without people around, everything else has gone haywire. We both came over from Virginia. Well, what was Virginia? There's a lot more hot zones that way. When the few spots that are livable, well, they got picked clean fast. I mean, Appalachia's dangerous, really dangerous. But it's better than where we've been. Watch yourself out there. Be careful with strangers. Not everyone's as friendly as us. Was there something else? Watch yourself out there.
I suppose your conversation with those two seemed on the up and up. Though I'd still be cautious of the rest out there. Now, was there something you required of me? I've been keeping watch here long enough to have learned that outside the vault, people don't always have one's best intentions at heart. I'm sorry to say it, but it's the truth. Until quite recently, it's been exceedingly peaceful. I maintained my post, greeted latecomers out of the vault, and otherwise reveled in Appalachia's natural splendor. But very recently, it seems people have come back to Appalachia. Those two and more to boot. The non-vault sort, you understand. It's all very concerning. Who knows what they might be up to? Well, yes, but it's been some time. But she was a resourceful woman. I, I'm, I'm sure she's all right. Oh, do be careful out there, sir. Enjoy this complimentary sample of wood must chop wood forever. Additional wood samples are unavailable at this time. Desirable wood product unavailable. Please return at a later time. Error. Wood 
Inventory depleted. Cannot dispense. Bullet sample. Lumberjack protectron does not want to lose. Lumberjack job to New face. Welcome to the Wayward. Duchess will take care of you inside. A couple of those vending machines on the porch if you just need bullets and meds. Did they issue you one of those camp things? Man, vault tex got some nifty toys. Lady, I will paint the walls with you if you don't tell me where Crane's treasure is right now! Sweetheart, I think you must be sick. Because point the gun at me in my own... Honey, you picked the wrong time to get a drink. What are you... Hey! Who the hell are... Whoa, uh, you, you, you looking for trouble? Because... because you're gonna find it!
Outnumbered? I... Shit. Fine. But don't think this is the end. Only for you, honey. No one pulls a gun on me in my bar. Mort! Get out here! Yeah? What, Duchess? Jesus! You let one of those monsters in here? Hey! You want to see if there's a tomorrow? Then I want you to tell me where you and the rest of your nuts crew is hiding out. What, what the... Mort, what was that? He called me a monster, all right? What? He was gonna kill us. I... You know, we could have asked him some questions. Oh. oh. You know what? It's safer this way anyway. I suppose. Thank you for the Check distraction with there, first. friend. Now, we can why don't you come over here, where I can get a look at you. Huh. Well, not exactly the introduction to the wayward I would have hoped for. Well, sorry about that, darling. First round's on me. Name's Duchess. There's something I could do for you. Your guess is as good as mine, sweetheart. He busted in here saying I needed to turn over the location of some fella named Crane, who I guess I must have served at some point or another. Since then, a steady stream of miscreants has been making my life irritating. Not exactly good for a budding business. Now that you mention it, I could use an extra pair of hands. See? That boy we put down? He's not the first of his crew to roll in here, but I want him to be the last. Normally, I'd send my people out to clean house, but my muscles run off, so I don't have the bodies to spare right now. But I'm willing to pay good money if you put an end to this for me. So, what do you say? That's what I was hoping. So, the details. Now, each of these boys came in asking after Crane. I'm thinking we can make that work for us. How would you grab the attention of a bunch of single-minded thugs? Well, aren't you a smart cookie? And I think I know just how to do it. Just give me one second. Uh -huh. Okay, I think I'll just... Uh... I just want you to know, architecture ain't exactly my forte. Huh, not half bad. So what I have chicken scratched together here for you is the schematic for one custom-made Crane Treasure Hunting Inc. sign. If I didn't butcher the plans too bad, it's got a little system built in that'll make sending out an advertisement and getting this gang's attention a snap. You just need to build it, use the tape it spits out to tell the world you're open for business, and then convince any punks that show up to tell you where their boss is hiding. They did teach you all how to build from schematics up in that vault of yours, didn't they? You vault boys and girls carry yourselves different, like you matter. Plus, your pit boy was a dead giveaway, but that's beside the point. You think you can work from these schematics? That's the spirit. Hey, if you need a refresher, good old Morty Mort can help you out. What are you on about, Mordecai? Hey, no, nah, I'm not bragging or anything. But I've got some tapes that cover that very subject. Oh, Mort, not the tapes. Well, you find yourself wanting a refresher? Talk to Mort. Of course you're gonna need materials. 
But we should have enough lying around to cover you there. Get you together a little care package. Throw some rations in there too, so you don't starve on me. And so you know, you might have to break some of this scrap down for parts. But I can spot you some workbench materials too, since you're doing me such a big one. Who knows? Maybe you'll learn something while you do it. Now, you ready to get this show on the road? It is a lot to ask. Fine. I could do 75. But that's as high as I'll go. That means you're up to the task? Hot dog. Be good to have those dolts off our back at long last. Just make sure, once you find out where they're hiding, that their leader gets the message. The wayward gets left alone. 